Hi, I'm Chris Duncan from Bikeskills.com. What you just saw me do is jump a tabletop. Today I'm going to show you how I use proper technique to jump with more control. First thing I do when I go jumping is put on some protection gear. Knee, shin, and elbow guards, and of course my helmet. Next, I lower my seat all the way down. And before I jump anything for the first time, I always get off my bike and check out the lip and landing. As soon as I'm rolling toward the jump, I get into the attack position. My elbows are up and out, I've got my strong foot forward on the pedals, and my legs are bent. As the back wheel leaves the lip, I move back and down, keeping my center of mass low and just past the seat. At the same time, I'm pushing forward on the bars with my palms to stabilize the height and angle of the front wheel. I straighten my arms out while keeping my elbows up and even. Here's a special tip. If one elbow is lower than the other, you will drift the direction of the lower elbow. While I'm in the air, I maintain the same position. Elbows up and out with a low rearward body mass, which is stable, strong, and allows me to land in control. When the rear tire makes contact, I absorb the impact by letting my legs act as shock absorbers. My elbows are still up and out. This gives me the maximum amount of control and leverage over the bike to ensure I roll out of the landing straight and in control. Here's how an advanced mountain biking skill like jumping can dramatically add to the fun, control, and safety factor in your riding. Watch for more in-depth how-to videos in the future from Bike Skills.